Good morning everyone, it's a cold winter day here in Elm Creek, right around 15 degrees. Today we're heading out plowing, so why don't we hop in that warm truck and let's get the day started. I just ran inside to grab a few snacks here because we're going to be out for quite some time. Over the last 16 hours guys, we've gotten right around 7 inches of snow. The first snowfall of the season, which I'm pretty excited for here. Now, uh, yesterday I did end up going out once here. So this is the final plow for the storm, which is pretty cool here. But take a look at this guys. This is our plow truck for today. It is a 2020 Chevy 3500 regular cab long bed with a 4x4 and we do have have a Fisher wide out plow here so really quickly why don't I just showcase this here it's so cool we have these mods already in farm sim you guys can see we could extend out both here and it, we could almost have it as a small box plow here so that comes in pretty handy we do have a lot of commercial accounts uh, some pretty big parking lots and that really those few extra feet on the plow each pass does add up and saves us quite a bit of time so why don't we get this day started now if you guys do end up enjoying today's video please hit that like button as it is much appreciated here but the first of our uh, driveways uh, lots is going to be this commercial one I believe this is a small local shop here now one thing I really want to do it we definitely want to use a wide out feature here that way we could get it done a lot uh, quicker here but hope everyone's been having a pretty good day here so far let me know how it is down below here I'm really really excited uh, to be snow plowing here in FS22 now I thought I would wait until we got some pretty cool mods like today which is pretty awesome now a few things guys uh, I did end up putting out some salt yes so you can see that it does work here some areas especially when the cars just drive on and just keep driving over the same areas I don't think we're gonna be able to completely scrape the entire parking lot uh, uh, clear like we usually want to but hey we could probably come out and do a salt run later on as well now a few things with that guys I do I need to get a salt sputter for this truck as well I always enjoy snow plowing here. Definitely one of my favorite things here. I've, I've actually been in a real life plow truck. It is pretty cool. And definitely will be if I can get you uh, some more real life snow blown videos as we do end up getting snow here. But look at the wide out plow. This thing really uh, can get the job done pretty quickly here for us. Now, there's always a car or two at every single parking lot here. Look at that. We can't win even if uh, we're in kind of the off hours for the businesses, which is no problem. It's just another obstacle, something that will work right around here. But why don't we get our hazard lights going? I do want to order a light bar, small LED light bar uh, for this truck. I think will be plenty. That way, people know that we're a plow truck because we are do a lot of backing up. And we just want to make sure we are safe and everyone around us is safe as well when we're plowing stuff. No. We have to get this back entrance here now. It is a little bit tricky here. Look at that snow came a little bit too early uh, for me to put out any plow markers here. But we should be able to do a pretty decent job at it. Turn up a little bit of the grass. But hey, we are still getting it done here as well. But look at that, guys. We are getting so many cool mods in FS22 so quickly here, which is so exciting. That means we could do and just uh, get to enjoy the game. And I will have to say, guys, I did a lot of snow plowing off camera and uh, the seasons mod with all the different snow plows in in game or the modded ones have really really improved here which is definitely great to see uh, it definitely improves the overall experience for not only me playing it but visually and for all my videos going forward here which is pretty cool we'll just get this entrance here and then we actually do, do have to do our rental shop which is right next door to this Thank you. 
Alright, this lot looks pretty good here, I will say, uh, just with one pass here, this does a pretty good job here. Definitely comes in pretty handy having the wide out, but hey, we're now going on some pretty narrow roads here, but we now have to do a few driveways, and then we actually do have a few big, big uh, commercial lots, which we're going to be doing. The winter months are always a lot of fun here. Definitely can do some fun things like snowmobiling, snowshoeing, things like that. And I do want to see if we could incorporate some of that here into uh, FS22 like we have in the previous games. And maybe do even more here. But I do have some pretty cool things here in the works. The first driveway uh, actually goes right alongside the fire station here. It's just a small one. And I, I will try to help out the uh, customer here by trying to get their walkway. Although I don't want to be tearing up the grass, we do really want to really quickly see if we could just help them on out here oh yeah look at that perfect we should be able to do one more here but i will say guys that character change that character customization is pretty cool here we do have a pretty good looking character i will have to say it looks awesome all right, we have one more residential driveway here. This is a pretty big one, and we do have cars flying by here. Now, I do really want the uh, uh, wings all the way out since this is a pretty uh, big driveway here. But I will say, guys, uh, this plow truck is perfect. I really do like the single cab long beds for snow plow. And the visibility is just a lot, a lot better than a crew cab here. That shorter wheelbase does come in pretty handy uh, for these tight areas as well. That definitely uh, is a pretty big thing here. But we do need to get a salt spreader here for it, a light bar, maybe some other things. Uh, if we don't end up putting a salt spreader in the back, I might just need to get a pow to salt. Uh, definitely add some weight. You could definitely tell every time I raise and lower the uh, plow, uh, the back of the truck gets a little bit too light, in my opinion. And we do need, uh, need some weight back there for some extra traction. But this is a pretty big property, pretty big, uh, cool driveway as well. Look at how big that barn is. Wow, I would really like a barn like that at my house. We're pulling in now to our two biggest commercial lots here. We are definitely going to have our work uh, here for probably the rest of today. There's just that much snow here, but we'll make sure the wings are completely folded out. I mean, we have both these big, big parking lots here. There is some extra cars here as well, so we're definitely going to have to work around that. As, uh, but I think maybe a skid steer might be the way to go here. I'm going to look to see if I could get a plow on a skid steer. I think that would be a pretty cool thing here. We don't want to be taking out any signs and really taking out any curbs here with the uh, plow because that usually is a pretty common thing and that means we're gonna have to be more than likely uh, repairing it or even paying for that damage ourselves here so we want to do a pretty decent job at it and I will say this truck looks unbelievable here I'm just a huge fan of it and these Silverados do look pretty cool but hopefully we can get some more uh, work trucks and farms and like a Ford maybe uh, we could get a Ram something cool like that all right, let's see if we get this laundry room at cleared on out here. There is a few cars in the parking lots, but uh, it, there isn't too many here, which I don't think we're going to run into anything here, but let's see, let's see. Now, I am in multiplayer, so I do apologize. That must be a connection, a problem there, but we should be able uh, to uh, pr uh, pretty much clear out this entire thing here. Now, this is a lot. Some lots are actually really good for pickup trucks. Other times, a big lot with a lot of obstacles, lots of small islands is where a skid steer really really does come in pretty handy here but definitely a, maybe a v-plow would be pretty cool i'm not sure if we have one of those yet in fs22 but that would be a pretty cool thing to try on out for a video or two and definitely do some multiplayer role play action now we don't want to get too close we definitely don't want to be hitting any cars i'm coming right as close as i can to them
Well guys, we just about have a laundromat plowed on out here. It's been several hours and we're making pretty good progress here. Now I think I'm gonna put down the camera and uh, get going on that grocery store parking lot here. So let me know down below guys, what did you think of today's video? Definitely the Duramax is doing a pretty good job here with the Fisher plow. But until next time guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next one and subscribe for more.